Big news this past weekend as Fort Bend County enacted an initiative to help struggling families with childcare during the pandemic. Always, uh, we are all, I'm, I'm always interested in what people are saying, what people are uh, talking about, what is important to them. And so um, uh, healthcare become a I mean, constantly it has become a uh, you know concern for so many people, and it was it was a concern before when everybody you know even when we had a stay-at-home order and things of that nature, um, but it was predominantly among those who need to work, our healthcare workers and our you know law enforcement and EMS and emergency managers and you know management uh, staff. Um, um, so those people, um, <clears throat> but now we see that some of these people have to get back to work. You know, the schools are not 100% operational at the moment, and you know, some many cases children are staying back, and you know, and and it is if you really think about it, my my thought process. Even though we like to feel everything is back to normal, it is not. We know that. And so anytime we talk to, um, um, you know, people, uh, communication, communicate with people, um, we come to find out healthcare is becoming, uh, always been a, a, a concern for many parents, especially parents that have small children. And, and so that's where we said, you know what, we need to do something about it. That's where we went and talked to, um, you know, so county, County cannot operate healthcare. You know, we are, we are not in that business, but we have partners like uh, Y, uh, Boys and Girls Club, and they interviewed numerous um, um, uh, established uh, healthcare providers. And so, <clears throat> uh, the the parents need to apply to the county, but we will, um, you know, compensate. They need to get approved, and but uh, we will compensate um, uh, these of more like I maybe I could call them vendors. And so when they provide the service, the vendors get paid. And, and that is the idea. They have to go through a, a, <clears throat> a application process and, you know, our consultants uh, will walk them through it. But my point is, you know, there is something we wanted to put it out there. Uh, you know, those who are really, really struggling about um, um, healthcare need. And that's where this whole discussion came. Um, and that's why we uh, finally decided to put some, put money aside for that particular purpose. The best way to reach out to, um, you know, is Fort Bend County website. And Fort Bend County, if you go to the Fort Bend County website, you, you know, uh, you will get this information very clearly laid out. Uh, also, they could call county's main number, 281-342-3411, uh, 281-342-3411. They could call um, if they don't have, I mean, some people, unfortunately, they don't have an internet connection or access to internet. So they could call that number. People are standing by. They will help. For Stafford CSI, this is Randall Williams.